Good morning, everyone. This is Jan from Organics 50 and Raw. I'm here in my garden, and I wanted to show you guys a couple things, but look at this beast of a tomato plant growing right into my black basil, So, and it's already even in a cage. So I'm gonna have to stake it a little, I'm gonna have to stake this branch that's coming off of it, but unfortunately I had two nice tomatoes growing and something ate them. So I was very sad to have lost something I wanted to eat. But I wanted to show you, come here Caden, I wanna show you too. So I was out here watering and do you see anything peculiar on this plant the flowers the flowers what else do you see this thing what is that thing a worm no, it's not a worm it's a caterpillar and it's not just any old caterpillar this caterpillar will turn into a monarch butterfly so little did i know that monarch butterflies liked dill so they're in here chomping away on my garden so we're actually going to move them before I spray my garden with neem oil. So Kaden, you wanna pick that up and we'll put him over on the bushes over there. Pick Monarch up. butterfly caterpillars. Wah! Wah! He's friendly, he will not bite you. Get on me. Let me see. Look at that's a monarch butterfly caterpillar. Cool. Isn't okay. he cool? Oh, he's very friendly. Hmm, nice. Are you scared? It feels good. You feel so I'm in from the garden. I uh, just planted a black zucchini plant. It was a little bitty, but Kaden stepped on it. But we're gonna really nourish it and hopefully it'll grow a branch that will give us some zucchini. I'm really feeling kind of hypoglycemic because I was out all morning doing errands and it's one grocery shopping and stuff. I did go to Hobby Lobby and got some more fragrance for my soaps. Some lavender and some orange peel, so I will be making soap again. Yay, I'm excited about that. Um, I, yeah, all I, I've eaten today, my quart of Barley Max with lemon, alkaline water, and Soleil, Himalayan salt brine. I ate some dark cherries and I ate about a cup of organic blueberries, so I'm feeling pretty hungry right now so i'm gonna eat i don't know i'm gonna eat till i'm full that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna eat mangoes till i'm full and then i'm gonna take some cucumbers and uh, pineapple to the studio with a little piece of ginger that i bought to make some cucumber pineapple juice and i want to show you guys these chips from heb roasted seaweed chips and the boys like these right kate right kaden they love them they love them and i've got a good dose of iodine in here and uh, that's about it. I'm gonna eat up my mango and get going. So I might be back with you guys today. You want a piece? Yeah. Kaden's like drooling for a piece of mango. So, all right, guys. Bye. Bye. So I managed to eat four of these big mangoes. I can eat about eight of the little honey mangoes but only about four of these big ones until I was very full and very satisfied. So, but some of you might be thinking, oh, that's so much sugar to eat, Jan. You can't, you shouldn't eat all that mango because it's very high in sugar. But actually, if you saw the video that I made the other day, glycemic index, glycemic load and carbohydrates, actually mango has a medium to high range on the glycemic index of 51, but it has a glycemic load of 12.8, which is a medium to low. Um, so, you know, it's not gonna spike my insulin and it is cal got a lot of calories that I need because remember when you're eating a raw food diet, you have to eat a lot of calories because think of the volume of a hamburger. A hamburger is about this size and probably about as dense. Well, that hamburger's probably got anywhere from 500 to 1,000 calories in it. But this has not got 500 to 1,000 calories in it. It takes me about, probably about four of these. Probably each of these mangoes has about 100 calories in it, I'm guessing. So four of them is a 400, I ate about 400 calories. And I need to do that because eating raw food, you have to eat more volume in, in order to get in enough calories for the day. 
and that is very important so you continue to feel full and you don't you don't run into nutritional deficiencies eating raw food by not eating enough raw food so yeah try it have a mango meal it's a mono mango meal that's a lot of, that's a long alliteration a mono mango meal <laughs> try saying that Caden a mono mango meal, a mono -mango meal. <laughs> bye